Hi, my name is Ashish, and in this video, we will see how to set up an Amazon CloudWatch monitor to the WordPress website that we have configured on the EC2 instance. Let me just quickly log on to the portal and take it from there. I am logged on to the portal, and it is always a good practice to shut down your instance that you are not using so that you don't get charged. So I'll start this instance and I'll delete that this instance after this lab is done instance is started and if you will see the documentation on the monitoring memory and disk metrics for amazon ec2 linux instances on the amazon documentation it says that we can use the cloudwatch agent to collect both system metrics and log files from amazon ec2 instances or from the on-premise server the agent supports both windows and servers in linux and enables you to select the metrics and uh, this is the guide for the on-premises CloudWatch monitoring scripts. It says the supported systems are Amazon Linux 2, Amazon Linux AMI. Required permissions is this. And it says to install the required packages on Amazon Linux 2 and Amazon Linux AMI. We have to connect to the Linux instance and we have to install the package on Linux or Ubuntu. So if I check my instance and I look for the operating system, but now it is Linux Ubuntu. AMI ID is Linux Ubuntu as you can see here. So I'll be following this. So if I use PuTTY to connect to my instance, let me just grab the public IP. Oh, I just got to know one thing I forgot to mention that so let's say you want to connect to this Ubuntu version and you do not want to use the your party client and remember we configured this instance to log in without an EC2 key pair so I'll say connect and I will say I would like to connect with EC2 instance connect browser based SSH connection that is wonderful thing so click on connect here and it will launch another window and it will enable the browser based connection to this Ubuntu server let's see how it goes oh the reason it is not because it is still running okay let's see if it's retry if this instance has just started up try again in a minute or two okay we'll do that so let me just pause it for a few minutes and I'll come back well I'm not able to connect to this instance because I remember because I did not uh, created a key pair to connect to this instance and every time I try to log on using the putty as well it throws an error that the key is not accepted so I'm stuck at not being connected to this user see if I'm trying to log in as root as well it's throwing me an error so, so what I'm gonna do is uh, I can I can create a new instance instance state settings Mm, screenshot image monitoring so I can do this CloudWatch monitoring from the system as well so enable detail monitoring if you want to enable it click on yes enable detail monitoring has been enabled so this is how you can do this as well so now if you would go to now if you would escape this and click on the monitoring tab there is there are no alarms configured so you can set an alarm as well that at this hour you want to do set an information you have to create a new topic that is simple notification service that another topic as well so now you know that you can enable the monitoring using the commands that i showed to you and from the console as well if you're not able to connect so i hope this was informative for you and if you have not subscribed to my channel, please do it. Channel name is Asar Cloud Chef. And I'll see you in the next video. Thank you. Bye-bye.